Assalamu alaikum. Dear students, hope you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIBS Home School. This is Muhammad Imdadul Haq, Assistant Teacher of Mathematics, National Ideal English Version School, Day Shift. Dear students, today I am going to take a math class of class 3. Our today's topic is chapter 7, EMB page 79, activity 5, question 4 and 5. I will solve these two questions today and two questions from page 80 I have given for your homework. Okay, dear students, let us start our today's class. Our first question from page 79, activity 5, question 4. I have written the question here, 401 taka, 15 paisa minus 50, 97 taka 80 paisa. It means that this is a subtraction. We have to do the subtraction here. So, we can start the solution here. Solution. The students, to do the subtraction, we have to write here at first 401 taka and then we have to write 15. <coughs> then we have to write 97 taka below 401 taka and we have to write 80 paisa and here is paisa. It means that we have to write the paisa below the paisa and we have to write the taka below the taka as this is a subtraction. So, I am writing here, I am giving the sign subtraction here. The students here observe that here is 15 paisa, here is 80 paisa. Is it possible to subtract 80 paisa from 15 paisa? 15 is smaller than 80. So, we can subtract. If we want to subtract, then we have to take one taka here. If we take one taka, one taka means 100 paisa, 100 paisa. So, if we take one taka with 15 paisa, we will get 100 paisa and then we have to add 15 paisa. Total will be 115 paisa. Dear students, now 115 is greater than 80. So, we can subtract now 80. If we subtract, subtract 0 from 5, it will be 5. Now, subtract 8 from 11, this will be 3. So, if we subtract 80 paisa from 115 paisa, we will get 35 paisa. The students, as I have taken one taka as loan, one taka as loan, we have to give that here. We have to give that one with 97. Now, 97 will be 98. We have to subtract from 401. Now, if we subtract 98 from 401, subtract 8 from 1, 8 is greater than 1, so we can subtract. So, we have to consider here 1. This is 11. If we subtract 8 from 11, this will be 3. Now, I have taken 1 as loan, so give that one here, this will be 10. So, subtract 0 from 0, now subtract 1 from 4, this will be 3. Now, we have obtained 303 taka. So, you can write here 303 taka. The students, I hope you have understood how have I done this and I will show you the next question. Before going to the next question, I have to write the answer for this question. So, answer of this question is 300. 3 taka 35 paisa. 
dear students in the same process we have to solve the next question this is also a subtraction so we can write here solution here 70 taka we have to subtract 32 taka and 50 paisa but here is no paisa if there is no paisa we have to write 00, zero paisa we have to write 00, zero paisa as we have to subtract so give the subtraction sign here then the student subtract at first paisa from paisa is it possible to subtract 50 paisa from 00, zero paisa as 50 is greater than 0 so we can't subtract if we want to subtract we have to consider here one taka one taka means 100 paisa so take one taka loan this will be 100 paisa now subtract 50 paisa you will get 50 paisa so if you subtract you will get 50 paisa then as I have taken one taka as loan, so I have to give that one with this two. It means that this will be 33. We have to subtract this 33 from 70. If we subtract, what will we get? Subtract 3 from 0, it's not possible. So take here 1, this will be 10. Now subtract 3, you will get 7. Now as I have taken 1, so I have to consider that one with this 3, this will be 4. Now subtract 4 from 7, you will get 3. So if we subtract 33 from 70, we will get 37 and this will be our required taka, 37 taka. Dear students, I think you have understood this subtraction also. Our required answer for this question will be 37 taka, 50 paisa. The students, again I am telling that you have to remember that, you have to remember that for this type of subtraction, you have to subtract paisa from paisa and taka from taka. In this case, if the paisa is smaller than the paisa which you want to subtract that time you have to take one taka as loan remember this don't forget and follow this technique to solve this type of question dear students depending on today's lecture i have given two questions for your homework this is your homework eight this homework is given from your book from your EMB book, page 80, activity 2, question 5 and C. Question 5 and 6. These two questions are related with these two questions. So, solve these two questions. I am showing your book. From where will you do the homework? <coughs> Dear students, this is question 5 and this is question 6. Do these two questions as your homework. Dear students, homework is important for your annual examination as your city marks, diary marks and SBA marks will be given based on the performance of, of your homework. The students submit your homework on the next Sunday and collect your previous copy on that day from 2 a.m. to 4 p.m. from the school library. Keep practicing at home, abide by your parents, stay home, stay safe. See you again, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum.